What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another amazing episode of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke. We are taking on Victory Road today, guys. We are getting close to the end. Now, if you missed the last episode, please go check it out. I did show you guys the Pokemon in our box. Minus Jirachi. We did get Jirachi in the last episode, but all that is there for you. I'm asking you guys to help me pick the six Pokemon that I plan to use in the Pokemon League. After this episode, I'm going to be training up uh, to try and get the Pokemon that we're going to want for that. If I don't have anything by the time I get to that point, I'm going to make my own best judgment, but I'm really, really excited for that. Now, let's take a quick peek at our team. <clears throat> um... Uh, not much has changed since the last episode. We've got Kev level 55, Fly, Gust, Recover, and Surf. Panda with Strength, Hidden Power, Dragon, Psychic, and Brick Break. Parish level 58 with Knock Off, Shadow Ball, Faint Attack, and Nightshade. Crimson did some amazing work in the last episode against our rival with Overheat, Cut, Flame Wheel, and Rock Smash. George level 55 with Thunder, Double Kick, Pin Missile, and Quick Attack. And then Neon level 35. Uh, still getting uh, some levels on this, but with Faint Attack, Taunt, Quick Attack, and Fury Swipes. Now, um, we do have Victory Road to go through today. There will be some trainer battles. I'm a little worried about some of those trainer battles. Uh, but on top of that, uh, we're hoping to get through... Uh, so next episode, we can actually start taking on the Pokemon League. Now, technically, this is our encounter in here. I'm not even going to catch it. I'll be honest. I hate Wingle. I think they're terrible. I absolutely hate... Uh, I think they're so bad. Uh, Wingle is so silly to me. All right, let's uh, let's use Strength. Let's get this boulder pushed over. I do have a bit of a guide up, though I don't think we'll necessarily need it. Um... You know, one thing I should do is put a repel up. Oh, Tapia! Oh, sad day. Uh, oh, I miss Tapia. All right, let's run away from this. Guys, I am so excited. We have, like, really done a lot with this series. Um, I, I obviously set about this with the intention of finishing it, uh, but I know, you know, oftentimes things don't work out and you don't finish a series and things like that happen, but I think we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Like, we are so close. Uh, hopefully we can win it, but even if we don't win, at least we can say we completed the series, and I think that's huge. Um, given how much goes into a lock like this, uh, it could take a while, so I'm very happy that it worked out, and we got through it pretty quickly. I do have plans for the next Nuzlocke challenge. Like I said in the last episode, it is going to be, at least the idea is it's going to be a Soul Link. Um, so I do have somebody else who is hopefully going to be jumping on with us for that one. Really excited about that, actually. I think it's going to be a great time, but we will see if it works out. Uh, we should hear more details, hopefully, in about a month. We're kind of in asset production at this point, where we're just trying to get everything together. Logos, you know, the the, the boring stuff, uh, but uh, hopefully the stuff that you guys will enjoy later on. So I want to make sure we put more production value into this one. Um, since this was a bit more of just like an offshoot, it was just kind of just gonna be a fun series. Uh, I didn't stress about doing anything too crazy. I mean, I, I like the production quality, but I think we could have done better. And so uh, I'm gonna shoot for that. Realistically, we should have swapped out to George, but I just didn't. All right. Um, all right, I guess we'll swap. We can hopefully thunder this thing out. I do have some hyper potions as well that we will probably use throughout this, but um, we'll see. Oh, come on, George. Don't do this to me. Don't do it. All right. Hit. Yes. Quad effective. Should knock this thing out, no problem. I was hoping Lugia could just knock it out, but uh, Lugia's fly not super effective against it, so it's going to take a little longer. Neon getting some XP, uh, Groudon, okay, that's a little scary, um, excuse me, uh, I mean, we have Surf, I think that's what we do, uh, and we hope that this one-shots, a little worried about that, a little worried about that, uh, we'll see, <laughs> we will see, the sunlight is strong, okay. Please one shot. Just get it out of here. Wow, that did nothing. Oh my gosh. Attack Rose. This might be a problem. Um This might really be a problem. 
I'm gonna recover. Okay, uh, that's actually fine. So that's good for us because we gained our health back. We did not waste a surf. And now we can just surf away at this thing freely and hopefully be able to knock it out in like three hits. I can't believe how strong this thing is. Maybe four. Oh my gosh. Groudon is bulky. I don't like that. <laughs> That's a problem. All right, let's do it. Can we get a crit? A crit would be helpful. That was good damage. Still asleep too. That's good. Uh, hopefully it doesn't like live on like one or two and then rest up again. That would be a problem. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. Why do I say things? Why do I talk? I can't believe that's literally what happened. Okay. This is gonna take forever. Um, I mean, this is the only... I'm looking through... Well, okay, we do have Panda. We could try swapping into Panda. I guess that works. Um, its defense is up. This should be a relatively safe switch since it's asleep. It's a choice brick break. I like to think that this should be enough to at least do some major damage, but we'll see if it uses rest again. Earthquake! Oh my gosh. Oh crap. Panda? Oh god! We about lost Panda. Alright, uh, we're gonna break break it. Get this thing out of here. That's way too close for- oh my gosh, that was so scary. Groudon? What in the world is your problem, dude? <laughs> Level 36, Neon. Trying to learn agility, that's not a very good move, so we're just gonna not do that. Gah. That was really scary. Alright, George, come on out here. Let's thunder this thing out. Holy crap. That was awful. Um, I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. Alright. Please hit. George, come on. Uh, now it should do more, right? With the rain. This this battle alone is gonna take us forever. Alright, come on. Yes. One shot. Please just one shot. I like it. George kicking butt. Neon getting that XP as well. And a Crawdont. We'll stay in. This person has five Pokemon. They're all level 50. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we're higher, but, like, come on. A Groudon? Huh. <sighs> All right. One-shotting a, a Crawdon, no problem. That's good. All right. Uh, and an Ampharos. We really don't have a good check for Ampharos here. Um, I'm going to throw Parish out and just Shadow Ball it. I think that might just be our, our best bet. Uh, Lugia obviously can't be a switch in on this, so it is what it is. Let's Shadow Ball it. Should be at least decent damage. I mean, it may not one-shot it, but it should do enough. Yeah, there you go. Thunder Wave, come on. This is awful. This is our first battle in Victory Road. <laughs> I just talked about how we finally got through so much of this game. <laughs> Please don't paralyze. Oh, thank you. All right. Get this out of here. We're healing up after this, because this is terrible. <coughs> Excuse me. Neon's level 37, though, so pluses, I guess. God, that was terrible. All right. Bag. Uh, we can use Max Potion, because realistically, we're going to get a, uh, a bunch of full restores here soon. All right. Uh... Sure, I'll just... I'm just using up some of these items, to be brutally honest. Um, we'll get full heal on this as well. Which I believe we still have a few of them. Yeah, 11. We got enough. Use that. Cool. Alright. 
mostly back to, to full health. Uh, obviously, Kev is not, but that's fine. Um, Alright, so we can do this. Which item do we want to go for? Let's just go here. TM1, which is Focus Punch. That's actually not terrible. Um, might end up using that. We'll see. Alright, let's fight another guy. Uh, this might be a slightly longer episode, given that there are so many trainers in here, but we will see. Dragonite. Great. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's fly. We don't have a check for it. I mean, we got nothing for a Dragonite. This is why I want your opinions on, uh, ooh, Dragon Rage. Your opinions on the team, guys. We need your thoughts on the team. Uh, we're just gonna keep flying. Please don't paralyze. Please don't paralyze. Thank you. Safeguard. Okay. Uh, really doesn't affect us too much, so that's fine. Yeah. Don't paralyze. Oh, thank you. I really wish Lugia had Aero Blast. Maybe that's something... If, if we do go through and, like, he's gonna Hyper Potion... Of course, why did I even do that? Um, we do need to, like, get the movesets where we want them for certain Pokemon and that kind of thing as well. Because um, there are certainly some missing pieces, I will say. That's guaranteed 40 damage. That's pretty good. Uh, Alright. No longer protected by Safeguard. So we use Safeguard. <laughs> Alright. I really wish we didn't have to battle quite so many people. Oh, that crit! that crit that crit all right we're gonna fly one more time why didn't I just gust these are the questions I ask myself very regularly as long as this hits good that's all that we needed all right Dragonite down neon getting some XP a Shedinja well luckily this is not a lock ender for us uh, Shedinja is frustrating for anybody that doesn't know the Wonder Guard on that is frustrating as all get out if you just don't have the Pokemon to deal with it. I'm just gonna Flame Wheel it. I think if you just hit it, it's pretty much dead, so like, <laughs> I don't think it's a big deal. Uh, Crimson getting a little XP, Neon getting some XP, a Stantler. Let's go out to Panda and we'll Brick Break this. <coughs> Excuse me. This is tough, and this isn't even the Pokemon League. <laughs> uh, Alright. Maybe we'll one-shot? Yeah, there we go. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. Get a little XP there, I like it. Uh, about to use Absol. I think we can just stay in. Alright. No longer protected by safeguard. Doesn't matter. Let's brick break. That should be good. Done. Easy. Thank goodness. All right. Get that out of there. Level 54 on Panda. Look at that. Panda getting up there. Neon getting some XP as well. And a victory bell. I don't remember if this is the last mod or not, but we'll go into Crimson. Should level up Crimson here, which is great. Yep. Last one. Perfect. Designer Dudley. I just realized the name. <laughs> awesome. All right. That should easily take out a Victory Bell and easily level up Crimson to level 54, which is great. Uh, I'm really liking our squad as a, as a whole at the moment. It's pretty good. And we are getting up there a good bit. So Neon getting to level 38. Look at that. All right. First floor is at least cleared out, which is great. So, second floor. Uh, don't remember all these little switches, but I'm just gonna go ahead and do the best I can here. Yeah. All right, do this. Do this. Opens something up. Um, okay. I'm gonna avoid trainers. Oh man, I literally just said I'm gonna avoid trainers and this is what happened. Oh crap, I didn't heal Lugia. Oh no. Alright, well. 
three Pokemon. We're just gonna swap out. As long as this doesn't pursuit. Please don't pursuit. Okay. Woo! Good. Alright. <coughs> George, let's do this. Thank you for hitting, George. Oh, you're amazing. Alright. That should knock out a Swellow. Yeah. Easy enough. Alright. This is so nerve-wracking, I feel like. Uh, a Tauros will swap. Panda. We're getting some nice XP, though, from this, which I certainly appreciate at this moment. <laughs> uh, to prepare us for the Pokemon League, we will certainly need it. Uh, I have not looked at the levels at the Pokemon League. We have to take into account... Oh, man, why did it have to swagger? We do have to keep in, in account the 20% level modifier, uh, which is a lot. Mistakes may have been made, but here we are. Yes! Panda, yes! That should easy knock out with Swagger on top of the choice. Like, oh, look at that. Easy. Panda, you're amazing. All right, and a Ladian. Uh, let's go into Crimson. We'll just overheat. This is the last one. All right. Perfect. Love the music. All right, Ladian's out of here. Perfect. We finished that one off. Let's make sure we heal up our Lugia really quick. Perfect. All right. Man, such a bulky Pokemon Lugia is. I love that. Um, let's go ahead and grab this item. Yo, a TM. Uh, I'm good with that. Need to remember to randomize the TMs. Uh, let's, again, make sure that we're using all these repels for now. Uh, I will be, like I said, leveling up stuff a good bit in between episodes, but for now, let's save ourselves some time. A soft sand. All right. Okay, so... There's literally just an item here. I'm gonna save myself the trouble and not go for it. <laughs> item there. Item there. Sunny day, look at that. All right, so we should be able to push this. Uh, I do know that like finding items is always really important in these games, but the reality is uh, the most important item is always a Master Ball. Um, we don't really have to worry about that this time around because we're pretty much done with encounters, uh, which is kind of crazy to me. Uh, since we're not doing any of the post-game, this, that isn't really something I'm super concerned about. Alright, let's do this. Uh, do that. That unlocks that one down there. <clears throat> uh, bag, max repel. Uh, I guess we should go down here. Uh, I'm ignoring the guide at this point, which is fine. Alright. Item, that's good. Super repel. I mean, I'll take it. Any repel is gonna be helpful. Uh, yeah, sure. Do we actually need this? We don't, right? This does nothing. Already been there. <laughs> Alright, uh, we'll see. Okay. Well, that reset this one. Or no. So, that's confusing to me. Uh, we'll see. There's that, there's that. Okay, so if we go this way. Since we can now. Repel's effect wore off, that's fine. Let's max repel one more time. Uh, get through here. Okay, we do need to drop this one down. <clears throat> All the way 
rid of the switch. All right. Okay. Doesn't matter. Where does this take us? Okay, so this lets us push it this way. All right, let's do this. Thank you, Panda, for just being amazing. Love you, Panda. All right. So this should unlock this other switch, which means we should be able to get through. Yeah. Oh, well, all right. Here we are. All right, let's do it. Uh, but this should be basically the end. There's like one more trainer battle, I think, after this. Swampert! No! <laughs> Swampert and Slowbro. All right. Uh, let's hit here. This is not a good matchup for... Whoops. Uh, let's swap to Parrish, who should be able to take on that Slowbro pretty easily. All right, wasted that protect, that's good. And they're withdrawing. That doesn't matter as much since we plan on special attacking it. Come on, do some good damage. That's fine, it's not great. This should do a good bit. I mean, Slowbro is bulky, but there we go. All right, one Pokemon down, Swampert still in it, uh, which is a little scary, but it's okay. Take down. Sure. That's fine. Uh, let's just Shadow Ball it. Ugh, oh, it's gonna protect. We're gonna just endlessly protect, aren't we? Alright. Yep. Stop protecting! Oh my gosh! Double protect! Ugh. And it works for both of the attacks. That's really frustrating. Um, I'm gonna Gust it. We're just gonna try and knock this thing out. So it can't keep protecting that crit? Yes! Heck yes. Kev, oh, so good. All right, get this out of there. <coughs> Level 56. Panda, Parish, Neon, getting some experience as well. Look at that. All right, Monpa. That's Monpa. <laughs> that makes me happy. All right. Let's go here. I think we have to, oh, we don't have to fight this person. You know what? We need to fight this person, I think. Oh, do we not fight this person? Oh, it's double edge. Oh, I see. I thought that was a trainer. I was gonna say, it's the last one. Guys, we made it through Victory Road. I cannot believe it. After all of this 28 episodes, I think that's correct. We made it through 28 episodes all the way here. Now, as promised, I am going to show you guys what's in our PC. Please feel free to share what you think our team should be. And in the next episode, we will start on the Pokemon League, not guaranteeing we're going to finish it in one episode. It may be a twofer, we'll see. Uh, but regardless, guys, this has been such a fun lock. Here is our team. Some heavy, heavy hitters, in my opinion, obviously, Jirachi. Uh, I love Polyrath quite a bit. We have a Sceptile here, we got Milotic, uh, we got some good stuff. We can evolve Graveler into a Golem if we need to, just a heads up. So that is our team, guys. Oh, let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you think our team should be. Uh, if I don't hear from you guys soon, I'm just going to make a decision on my own. But regardless, guys, thank you so much for supporting this series. Please make sure to share it if you feel like you should, uh, if you're enjoying it. It does mean a lot to us. So thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next episode where we will hopefully be taking on the Pokemon League for the win.